From Creamer Media in Johannesburg, this is The Real Economy Report. Luxury aviation company Executjet last month officially launched and welcomed the Pilatus PC-24 to its fleet at the company's private terminal at Cape Town International Airport. Simone Lietke reports. Developed by Swiss original equipment manufacturer Pilatus, the PC-24 aircraft is the first of its type delivered to South Africa and on the African continent. The aircraft does not fit into any of the existing business jet categories, but rather fits into a category of its own, the super versatile jet category. The PC-24 has been engineered to be off-road compatible from the beginning, with outstanding short field performance, even on unpaved runways. This, according to business aviation company ExecuJet, affords the plane an incredible level of mobility and cements the company's reputation for having a modern and capable charter fleet. The aircraft delivers the latest in in-flight comfort and technology for passengers and combines the versatility of a turboprop with the cabin size of a medium light jet and the performance of a light jet. The PC-24's interior has combined comfort and functionality, with each component having been carefully chosen to enhance the passenger experience. Components include soft leathers and hardwood cabinetry which creates a bespoke interior that reflects a meticulous design. This generously sized cabin boasts a continuous flat floor and allows for exceptional headroom for both passengers and crew. Considering that production of the aircraft only began last year, the initial order book for the PC-24 was sold out within a matter of days after being launched. The 14th aircraft will be delivered to the client soon, and first customer delivery of the PC-24 took place in February. ExecuJet will engage with various owners of the PC-24 to place the aircraft under their management, with the company's own plane based in Cape Town, but able to service clients wherever required. With about six passengers per trip and departing Cape Town, the aircraft can reach Angola, Zambia, Malawi and Mozambique. Passengers will also be able to reach the Democratic Republic of Congo, Tanzania, Kenya and Mauritius from ExecuJet's fixed base operator at Lanciera International Airport in Johannesburg. Other news making headlines. Intermodal transport systems are vital for growth in South Africa and the SADC region. Gauteng Roads and Transport MEC Dr. Ismail Vadi has said that intermodal transport systems are vital for economic growth and development in South Africa and the Southern African Development Community region. It is the, the intermodal or multimodal transportation is perhaps the best opportunity this region has to stimulate economic growth and to strengthen the region economically. Currently, uh, we're not doing too well as a region. At a global level, if you look at the global value chains linked to this, uh, we're not a significant exporter of goods uh, and also not a significant importer of goods and services. So uh, we are perhaps an underperforming regional economy and at, a, at an intra-regional level, we're not doing very well either. That's Creamer Media's Real Economy Report. Join us again next week for more news and insights into South Africa's real economy.